Okay, we have some letters to you. This is a deck that I created. A little letters to you. Um, so we're going to see what mail is addressed to you. We're going to see what mail is addressed to you. Okay, first we have, dear you, you have no clue how much power you hold. It's time to tap in and let go of all that no longer serves you. Okay, we have, dear you, listen to your spirit, make them your best friend, the best thing you can do. Your spirit will not steer you wrong. Listen to your inner voice. So listen to that inner voice, okay? It looks like it's time for you to... Uh, it's time for you to tap in, okay? You're very, very powerful, and you have no idea how powerful you are. We have here, dear you, true beauty. Do you know how truly beautiful and amazing you are? You are so, so much more than you. Than you are so, so much more than you think. You must believe this and open your eyes, love. So listen, I'm seeing somebody who don't even know. I'm seeing here somebody don't even know how beautiful and amazing and how you may know that you may be a little powerful or whatever, but you have no clue to as how powerful you are. Okay? Okay, we have here... Dear you, trust yourself. Trust your intuition. Do not ignore it. It'll cost you later. That is your guide. It will not harm you, but protect you. Trust yourself. Okay? So, it's time for you to trust yourself. Tap in. Nestle even closer to spirit. Okay? We have here dear you it doesn't matter what no one else is doing do you know there's no one like you you have your special something to contribute please don't doubt that no matter how small it is okay we have here dear you are you worried about the mistakes you made in this life don't forgive yourself show remorse move on you're going to make mistakes and big ones. How else will you learn? Please know that it is okay. It's only wins and lessons, no loss. Okay. Okay, so then we have here at the bottom, dear you, be nice to yourself. Speak nice and highly to yourself to manifest good things. Do not belittle yourself ever because then that will manifest. And we do not want that, do we? So show yourself some love. Show yourself some love. Love on you, okay? And again, I just want to repeat this again. It's time for you to nestle closer to spirit. You're a very powerful being and you have no idea how much power you hold. And it's time for you to find that out, okay? And it's time for you to trust yourself more and trust your intuition, okay? Let's see. We're going to... We're going to put some personal power... And then since we have talk nice to yourself, we're also going to add some affirmations. Okay. And then just bear with me. I'm trying to see what all we're going to use for this reading here hold on I'm looking for yep here we go and one more deck all right so time
time to get started. Okay. So we're going to see some affirmations that you can say to yourself and speak more kindly to yourself. Here. Let's see. What do we have here? Okay, we have see, we have here. I am more than enough. Know that you are enough. You are truly a true beauty. Uh, it's very powerful and you don't even know it. And that makes you very special too. It says here, I am a student. Okay, so you are learning. You are learning this about yourself. It says here, I am balanced. So say that to yourself so that you can come into balance. It says here, I am creative. I am a creator. Okay. Okay, it says here, I am an empathetic empath. Okay, so you are an empath. I am protected. You are protected. I am compassionate. You are compassionate. Okay, it says here, I am wealthy. So you are very wealthy. I am music and poetry. Okay, and I am bold. Okay, so you're very bold, very daring. Okay. It says here, I am a teacher. Okay, so you're also learning and you're going to be teaching others. It says here, I am love, loving and loved, okay? And at the bottom here, it says, I am glowing, okay? So it's time for you to get your glow on. I'm just going to repeat these one more time, and you need to say these to yourself on the daily here. It says, I am love, loving and loved, okay? I am a teacher. I am bold. I am music and poetry. I am compassionate. I am wealthy. I am protected. I am an empathetic empath. I am a creative creator. I am more than enough. I am balanced. And I am a student. Okay? So you are learning. Okay? Let's get some follow your heart messages. Okay? We have here leap and find your wings okay so take that leap okay you're powerful and you will get caught you're protected you ain't gonna take a leap and splat <laughs> okay take that leap we have here love leads you home so everything that you go through okay and the love for something the most high it will lead you home okay This is what it's for here. It says lean in anyway. So yeah, regardless of what you feel, and then you see she's covered, okay? So you might not know what's going to come of this or whatever the case may be, but still lean anyway, okay? Take that chance. Take that leap, okay? We have here, yeah, surrender to your soul. You need to surrender to your soul, okay? Know that your heart can't break. Okay, and we are one. Okay, so know that you are one. You're one with um, the world. You're one with the people in it. You're one with the Most High. Okay, you need to be one with self. Okay, so only now is real. So only right now is real. Not the past, not the future. Right now in this present moment. Okay, we have here care for yourself. So definitely, yes, definitely give yourself some love and give yourself some self-love okay remember your true self so yeah it's time for you to come together and be one with yourself and remember who the heck you are because you was powerful okay uh we have here nurture love and expand so nurture that love within so that you can expand spread them wings you see that light shining on her very very beautiful here we have here you create your pain so know that you do create your pain with your thoughts um and what you're thinking okay and you can overcome that okay because you created it okay we have here surrender and be at peace so yeah you need to surrender this pain so that you can be at peace surrender it to the most high okay at the bottom of the deck choose to see abundance so you need to choose to see abundance in everything okay and you can see a uh, red cardinal birds too as well that could be of significance here um okay since you're very, very powerful, we're going to see and tap into that personal power of yours.
Okay, it says here, I speak highly to myself. This is so beautiful. Okay, listen. I speak highly to myself. You are safe. Know that you are lovable. You're smart. You're unique. You're beautiful. You're free. And you're worthy. You have to know that. You have to speak those to you. And for it to come out twice, you don't be saying so much nice things to yourself. And you need to love on yourself and speak very highly to yourself so those beautiful things can manifest. It says here, I am wild and free. Okay, so you are wild and free. Okay, it says here, I am happy. Okay, it's time for you to tap into that true power of being happy. It says here, I follow my heart. So follow your heart. Um, where is that card at? I just want to put these two together back to what I was saying with this lean in anyway. And you see she's covered. Can't see. You see the eyes are covered. You need to follow your heart. Again, that leads back to you trusting in yourself and trusting your intuition and trusting the spirit here. Okay, it says here, I am knowledge. So you have a lot of knowledge. Very, very wise. And you have a lot of spiritual knowledge. It says here, I am sacred. So you are a sacred being. Okay, it says here, I have a higher purpose. So you definitely have a higher purpose. Where's that other card at? I just want to point these out. Okay. Yeah, you have a higher purpose, okay? Because you're learning, okay? Because you're going to be a teacher, okay? And you are here to create, okay? So know that you have a higher purpose and a higher duty to create, to teach. That's a lot. Okay? It says here, I am hopeful. Okay? So you have a lot of hope within you. Excuse me. Okay? It says, I trust my intuition. Trust your intuition. Okay? I am safe. Okay? So you're very safe. Okay? And you are protected. Know that and trust that. Okay? It says here, I am open to receive. So you need to be open to receive this love, this power, um, and knowing who you are. You need to be open to receive it. Okay, I am worthy. You are worthy and you are more than enough. Okay? Do you know how truly amazing and beautiful you are? Okay, I am unbreakable. I'm just pointing out, I just want to show you all how it's just all tying in very, very be beautifully. I am unbreakable, okay? Your heart can't break. Okay? I am confident. Okay, so remain confident, you know, within yourself, okay? Last shuffle, any more? Okay? And then at the bottom of the deck, we have I am curious, okay? So remain curious. That is good. You remain curious. You find things out. Okay, so we have omen, and then we have the candle, okay? So things, um, things are being illuminated to you, okay? Who you are is being illuminated to you. Um, you're being shown just how powerful you are, okay? And you can see a lot of omens, a lot of signs. Like I said, if you see cardinal birds, a different bird, 
numbers, music, radio, TV, different sounds, okay? Those are omens. When I just burped, omen, okay? Um, you need to liberate your mind and your, in, in your heart to allow your soul to take off, okay? It's time to... Where is that card at? That I wanted to point out, okay? It's time to spread those beautiful wings. Look how look at the, how beautiful that is and how the light shines. Okay? It's time for you to open up, okay? But things are definitely being illuminated to you. Okay? So again, see here, yeah, these on oh, this. Sorry, it's all jumbled up. These omens are messages. Okay? These omens are messages, okay? Yeah, so you need to take, uh, roll the dice, take a gamble. Gamble on yourself. Gamble on knowing and finding out who you are. Or shoot, take a gamble, play the lottery, because it looks like you got some good luck, okay? And you can see black cats. Okay? Those are all signs. Okay, yeah. Smoke prayers, okay? So know that your prayers are always heard, okay? You're very powerful, okay? You are beloved. When you pray, they are heard. Okay? So let's see it's here. Uh, pendulum, so decision. Okay, so you have this, some decisions to make. If you're going to tap into that full potential and that, um, and that full power and... Um, fickle did come out okay and not be fickle with you know making that decision to step into your power and get to know your true self so you have a decision to make to fully trust here yeah and trust in that healing okay and we have crystals here so i'm actually going to pull from the crystal deck too since that came out Okay, so you uh, need to do some healing here. You have the gift of foresight here. So you probably see and sense things before they even occur. So that's very powerful. Okay, yeah, observation, your aura. Okay, so you can glow. Okay, and then you can also see the different colors within that. You can have a rainbow aura, which is very beautiful and powerful. Okay, we have clouds, mystical clouds, so you definitely uh, communicate with the divine and these messages and everything comes straight from the divine here, okay? We have nature here, so you can, uh, nature could be a big factor, okay? And you need to connect uh, with nature, okay? You have the wisdom of an oracle here. What's that? Okay. Yeah, you have the wisdom of an oracle here, okay? So you can see, okay? foresight you have the wisdom of an oracle here um very very powerful so i'm seeing you an empath or oracle um unbreakable free beautiful um your prayers are heard you getting messages from the divine how powerful and how beautiful you are knowledge Okay, and we have the book of knowledge. This is your destiny. You're finding out your destiny here. Okay, yeah, the book of knowledge, book of destiny. Okay, you're an oracle. This is your, this is um what you're destined to do. Um, bottom of the deck, crystal ball, which is you receive clarity. Right after that, destiny, and that's where your abundance lies. You can see numbers. Okay. Okay, this don't belong in here, 
but check and see what's in your seventh house okay that talks of justice your friendships contracts so you contracting you finding out what you're uh, meant to do here business and business partners equality true love everything check and see what sign is in your um seventh house okay let's see what we got here we got the ant patience here okay so you could be nervous don't be nervous because you can probably self-sabotage here so just wait continue to care for self here we have the ant so you're currently waiting okay yeah so again like i said before you can see crows uh too as well okay so you know the law okay you have virtue uh you correct yourself um and then we have the warrior so you are a warrior here um you are very determined again and that talks of purpose too so you have a purpose here we have alligator which is integration so you're processing things uh digesting maybe information that you receive too as well and then we have here grace the swan okay so surrender and trust okay it's so important for you to surrender and trust um what is going on because you don't want to self-sabotage here so we have the dog loyalty okay so you could be very loyal okay remain dedicated okay because you will receive the support even if you don't have support from uh people around you the most high will send you the support that you need okay we have pursuit the moth okay so that talks about your intuition and trusting your intuition and you have an insight and in using that instinct because you're very very powerful here and then we have here cosmic ordering the grasshopper so that talks of your words your expression okay okay and know that everything is in cosmic and divine cosmic and divine order okay let's see last shuffle anything else okay that was it we have at the bottom of the deck the uh ibis that talks of knowledge okay so you're again you're very i ain't even gonna point it out y'all know that it came out about three times you are the all of the power that you have is in that knowledge in which you know in the information that you have in the answers that you have and that imagination that you have very powerful very very beautiful okay and since self self-care okay had came out we're gonna um pull some self-care messages um that you can do too as well let's see here last shuffle okay so you create your reality make your thoughts positive right now because what you thinking about and everything that is manifesting it says embrace your feminine energy so even if you are a male you need to embrace that feminine side within you too as well it says here sit up straight Sit up straight, shoulders back. Sit up straight, shoulders back. Now shine with confidence. It says here, ouch, you are meant to have all that you desire, okay? And then it also says here, higher, vi higher your vibration. Turn on your favorite song. So turn on your favorite song. Get to dancing. Move them hips. Okay? And it wasn't no bottom of the deck because, you know, both of the cards were turned over. Okay? So this is the title card. So, yeah, definitely work on your self-love and knowing how truly beautiful you are. And then on the other side, so I'm going to consider this is the bottom of the deck here. It says here, you are overthinking. Ground yourself with yoga, with the yoga tree pose. So you may want to do some yoga, okay? You could be overthinking too much, uh, which could cause self-sabotage as well, okay?
Okay. So we have here some songs that you can listen to. We have Khalid, Young, Dumb, and Broke. That can be of significance. We have Kiana Lede, Good Girl. That could be of significance. We have Rashad, Isaiah Rashad, Stuck in the Mud. We have Camille featuring Adeline Mango. We have Kalani featuring Music Soul Child Footsteps. And then we have Mark E. Bassey, Where We're From. Okay, I'm going to run through them. I'm going to run through them again. Okay, we have Mark E. Bassey, Where We're From. We have Kalani featuring Music Soul Child Footsteps. We have Kemayu featuring Adeline Mango. We have Isaiah Rashad, Stuck in the Mud. We have Kiana Lede, Good Girl. And we have Khalid, Young, Dumb, and Broke. Okay? And then we're going to end it off. Since, um, since it's talking about your true power and you not knowing how powerful you are and how truly beautiful, beautiful you are, we're going to end it with and this doesn't even belong in this deck. So, listen, you're on a journey, okay? You're on a journey to discovering all of this here, okay? But we're going to end it um, with seeing how powerful you are, okay? We're going to see who you are. Okay, this is what we're going to end it read with. Just to see how beautiful and powerful you truly really are. Okay? shuffle how powerful are they Yahweh how powerful are they how powerful how powerful okay bottom of the deck so you have the power of manipulation so you're a manipulator you can transform into someone that you are not to fit your agenda making you extremely crafty in achieving your dreams and goals be sure to use the gift wisely Okay, so we're going to gather these up for you so that I can finish telling you how powerful and wonderful you are. You powerful. A lot came out, okay? A lot. Most of the day. You might not know who you truly are. Excuse me. Well, that was pick up. Okay, so I'm seeing here you are a warrior. And you have a warrior spirit. And you're not afraid to face conflict. Okay, and you still remain committed on your path and journey through it all. Okay, you are a wild card. You unpredictable. Okay, your qualities are uncertain. You can't be held down and nobody knows what to expect from you because you're a jack of all trades. Okay, you're young at heart, so you have a very youthful energy. Okay, you can see it in your eyes. Um, you, you are a hidden treasure. Okay, self-love. Okay, so you advocate self-love again. Yeah, so important. This is beautiful. Okay, so we have here self-love. Um, I'm just loving the energy of today. Don't mind me. Okay, but your, your body, mind, and spirit, and you teach others about self-love, okay, so that they can love themselves. You overcome, okay, so you since you've gone into battle and was being that warrior, you overcame your dark side. And you can see the divinity and the sacredness in the darkness and in the destruction, okay? I always like to say there's beauty in the chaos, okay? And then we have here a mirror. So you're the ultimate mirror. You disrupt things in order to enable people to see themselves differently so they can begin to heal. 
okay and then we have an old soul so you've been around many lifetimes and you have chosen to be reborn in this current time okay to evolve and carry on your learning um your learning journey from where you left off in your previous life okay and i think that yeah student and teacher um came out here and then we have inhibited you are unbridled with erotic energy it's the purest tantalizing form having the ability to help others release their sexual fears and be more authentic in their sexual expression okay and then we have here telepathy so you have the gift of telepathy and it's very strong you have the ability to read minds and project thoughts uh, you can look into other people's minds and understand um, your own body and mind as well as others. Okay, we have the fight. Okay, so you have the power to make the opposite sex fight for you. Okay, provoking jealousy in those that fall under your spell. Okay, and the spell is just you. Okay, so you got people wanting to fight for you. Okay, and you're not afraid to fight. You see she got her brass knuckles on. Okay, so you ain't afraid to get down and dirty yourself. We have here resilience, okay? It says here, you don't give up despite the obstacles ahead. You know how to take care of yourself and find peace in the storms of life. So even through the storms, okay, um, the Most High has made your burden light. So you can see the calm even within the storm, okay? We have daydreamer here. So you can, um, you, you can use your imagination and creativity to create a wide array of routes to success and build your dreams and to live in abundance here you are the wild card okay you're very rebellious but it keeps people on a roller coaster you're not afraid to break the rules and rebel against authority to achieve your goals okay you have healing hands you're able to use universal energy with your hands to help people alleviate spiritual physical or mental suffering and energetic blockages okay you are a witch Okay, you have a strong connection to the universe that is developed through study and practice. You can live an empower, empowered life that can bring forth positive changes. You are a boss, okay? You ain't meant to work for nobody. And you have your ish together and um, being precisely who you are and in hot pursuit of your goals and they, cap and they captivate and inspire others. Descendants. Okay, so you come from a long line of these healers and herbalists and wise folk. Their ancient knowing resonates today deep in your spirit. You will know yourself by knowing them. Heartbreaker, you, in, you easily inspire romantic feelings in others because of your own kind and sweet approach, making you a heartbreaker. You, water, you could be a water sign too as well. You are deeply connected to water and the spirits that dwell within it. Water magic suits you to conjure up love spells, emotional healing, or any other matters of the heart, okay? I wouldn't recommend love spells, okay? But, you know, use the water for healing. Make sure you drink a lot of water, too, as well. We have here the gift of detachment, okay? So you're a deep thinker with a high level of emotional intelligence and awareness. Your vibration creates a ripple effect which makes others more aware of their own emotions. You're also a channeler, okay? So again, you, um, where is that? You're a channeler. You definitely get those messages from the Most High. You have a heightened consciousness, having the power to channel divine messages. having the power to channel divine messages you have the ability to open people's eyes to the unforeseen femininity you you're a mix of girlish charm and mature sensuality you can draw them in without them even knowing a suitable uh, luring effect you are a shaman you can tap into powerful way of guiding your life and the lives of others often through great struggle that you learn to break free and awaken to the truth to help others. You are a seeker. Your natural thirst for wisdom and truth 
uh, elevate your spiritual journey and self-awareness to help those that are also in search of the answers on their own path. Crystal child, you're here to uplift the planet of harsh energy, bringing forth healing and peace and also assist humanity in soul growth and evolution. Storyteller. So, yeah, you're definitely a storyteller. And whatever stories you got to tell, you need to put them out, um, you know, for the people here. We have here, you have the ability to express life through stories and enhance your magic with symbols. Spirit may also communicate with you through synchronicity. We have here, sophisticated. You have a higher understanding of sex and sexuality. It's authentic and empowering, often having a shocking effect on people and provoking insecurity within others. Okay, you are an arouser. You provoke sexual arousal like a phantom dancing with them in vibrational dance to enchant, tease, entice, and play with their most deepest hidden desires. Relationships. You have a talent for mentoring and counseling relationships, having the ability to guide others to their path to love because of your own experience with your own experiences within love so you don't you go through nothing for no reason past lives so you're regal you're seductive and you've been here before and and just a bit dangerous with the cleopatra energy you hold is so strong you intimidate your prey a very strong connection to egypt air you have a strong connection to the air element, link with the mind, the intellect, communication, and divination. Be sure to spend time outdoors to recharge yourself. Okay, and I don't know what, why this popped up in my head, but let me find out you the last airbender. <laughs> you might want to watch the Avatar too. We have hope here. So you offer the most valuable gift there is, and that is hope. Through your optimism and support, you inspire hope in others. Rebellion. Your rebellious mind is a force that is able to remove the smoke screens which cloud the mind. Someone who follows their own path, not just what is popular. Diviner. Okay? You, can, you have a natural talent for divination, uh, revealing what is hidden, or hear answers that may come in many forms. To help point you in the right path. Okay, we have Illuminator. You radiate energy that lights up any room with great power to heal those around you and crack their hearts wide open. This gift can make people run from your light. Okay? <laughs> so listen, that beautiful rainbow aura I was talking about. Okay? And Illuminate, listen, you, you are light. Okay, you illuminate things. Okay, you're an illuminator. Okay, and people might run from you. Just try not to internalize that, uh, the fact that, you know, people may run from you. Okay, we have performer. So you're meant to be in the spotlight and be successful doing it with a natural ability to draw a crowd and influence others with your charm and your talent. Okay, and then last but not least, we have knowing. So you have the ability to connect on a deeper level with people and talk in ways they feel heard. Being able to penetrate their veil often leaves people feeling vulnerable. Okay? So basically you're like the knower that knows. You already know. You could have been born under a crescent moon too as well. And since the healing crystals had came out, I said I was going to end it. I'm going to give you all a crystal that you may can purchase or um get here okay can i have a crystal for them please what crystal would help and resonate here So, we have here the Serapos Green Quartz. So, you may want to purchase that. Let me put the name here so you can write it down. Uh, 
okay and with this um with this crystal here it says life on life's terms joey d vivier and acceptance of your place in the world heaven on earth what it's meant to be okay so you're meant to have heaven on earth not later but now i know they say when you pass you go to heaven but no you can inherit it now okay especially with how powerful you are here you need to release and keep what needs to be left behind left behind surrender uh and surrender to the gifts of right now okay again i hope you all got a message from this read thank you all for listening um you all be blessed and love you